Hey there. So, uh, how do I put this? Gordon here with Snake River Bushcraft. I know I've introduced myself as Sean a hundred times, but that's my birth name. And it doesn't reflect who I am anymore. So, from now on, I hope you'll all accept that I'm Gordon. I'm non-binary and that name bears a lot of significance to me. I just wanted to let you know, Gordon with Snake River Bushcraft here, hoping you all have a wonderful Pride Month. Thank you. I developed my love and affinity for the outdoors at an early age. Whether I was camping with my parents or the scouts, I was always learning more. And as I grew in my experiences outdoors, I grew in my experiences in life. I came to discover new language to help me express who I am and who I've always been. I didn't always fit in with the other boys but that's because I didn't have to. So I kind of wanted to make a video about um, being a queer outdoors person. Um, hmm. It's a very masculine dominated field to say the least. There's a lot of people that put a lot of machismo into just coming out here and having a good time. And it doesn't have to be that way. I think making the outdoors accessible to anybody who wants to come out here has always been my goal. I've never really talked about why. I'm differently abled, I have autism spectrum disorder, and I find more comfort out here than I do in the city. What I really wish is that I could see more AFAB and um, feminine and queer folk doing these things, making content like this. A real joy to be out here. It's Pride Month. <laughs> I'm back at it. And as alluded to earlier, um, yeah, I'm queer, non-binary, and I'm happy to be a person that goes out here and does fun things and shares them with you all. It really is a pleasure and a blessing to do so. I like the idea of defying expectations and being somebody that can put on some smoky eyeshadow and some eyeliner and some purple lipstick one day and go out and build a lean-to and a campfire for myself the next. And um, I really don't think that these are masculine traits inherently. I think anybody can go out and do these things if they set their minds to it.
There are places anyone can get to with varying ability levels and experience levels. And all I want is for you to have faith in yourself and go out and try. No matter what anybody thinks or says. Anyhow, I oh don't know. I'm here. I'm queer. You're probably used to it. I'm just happy to be here with you. Thank you. Zina! Hey, come here, friendo. Good dog, oh. <laughs> yeah, good mornings. And good morning to you, bushcrafters. How we doing? Oh, give me a second. I need some coffee. Oh, gosh. Oh, so we slept pretty well last night. Woke up a couple of times to uh, animals traipsing through. No big deal. Um, Zena wanted to scare him away, but I'm like, stay under the covers, doggo. <laughs> stay warm. Stay with me. Keep me warm. It was nice. Yeah. We got a fire going so we can start our cobbler once we have enough coals. We're going to have a nice papaya, pineapple, and blueberry cobbler. Something really festive and fruity. <laughs> like me. Okay, yeah. So that's the topic of this video, really. Um, I wanted to talk about being a queer creator on YouTube that does outdoor stuff. Now, I have seen AFAB people out there doing this and I absolutely love that there's not a lot of non-binary people like myself doing it and I'd love to see more of that so if you have a camera a sleeping bag and a couple of other things you can get started if you just go out there and keep a couple of safety things in mind you know review a couple of my other videos and other content creators and see what work what might work for you and what might not but we need to have just a little more diversity out here in the woods, I feel. There's so many masculine people that do this stuff and so many AMAB people that do this stuff that I feel that the field is kind of drowned out and it's not a bad thing to make things with your hands and do these things and get dirty. I don't think that those are inherently masculine or uh, manly traits per se. I think that anyone can do them. Give me a sec. There we go. But yeah, I just wanted to share with you all that uh, I'm non-binary. I'm happy to be out here all the time. And that I want to see a little more diversity out here. <laughs> 